What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Angel coming at you with another haul, man. I can't believe I hoarded books so fast. I just did a video two days ago, and here I am making another video, man. Um, I got some fire books, man. Uh, one uh, comic book hunting all this weekend. My local Maryland shops. Um, hit up my local Comic Con. Big shout out to the Comic Dojo. Uh, follow him on Instagram. Uh, really cool dude, man. Met him up today, you know. Did a little bit of hunting with him. Hit those long boxes, you know. Talk a little bit with him. Really cool dude, man. Uh, big shout out to the Comic Dojo. All right, man. Without any further ado, let's get this haul going because I'm pumped about this haul, man. I want to share with you guys some of the books that I found at some bargain prices, man. Stay away from eBay, man. Hit the fucking wild. Hit the fucking comic shows. Just dig through the boxes, man. There's deals to be had. All you have to do is look, man. All right, let's do this. First book I got up today is Micronauts number one. You know, something a little minor. Um, this specific dealer that I go to, he has uh, select books, five for 20 bucks. So, or, you know, $5 a piece. So, why not get it for that? So, I got Micronaut number uh, one as part of that five for twenty deal that he had, and I picked up Mune's annual number two for ten bucks. The first appearance of Cyclops, so it's another one of those um, five for twenty books. Sandman number one, all right. And then this is an upgrade, man, because I just got this book at the Big Apple Con, and I found one in the wild yesterday. I one of my local comic book stores in Maryland. Man, this thing is clean, man. Uh, Marvel Spotlight number 28. Uh, first Moon Knight solo story. Picked that book up for 9 bucks, man. I was pumped. And it's clean. The last one that I had um, had some writing on it. You know, the 25 cent mark was uh, had some writing on it. Had a number one. This one's clean, man. Probably like a fine copy. So, happy to upgrade. And then... Got Shadows number one for I think it was eight bucks. Um, really love that cover, man. So I picked that up at a comic look, com local comic book shop in Maryland. Um, along with this other book right here that I paid five bucks for Classic Jack Kirby, man. Mr. Miracle number four, first appearance of Big Barda. Um, man, any Kirby's good Kirby, my book. You know, once he went to D.C., he was still the same, you know. The king, you can never have too many Kirby's in your collection. And if you can pick them up, you know, for $6, $5, man, come on, man. It's Kirby. You have to pick them up. All right? Then I picked this bad boy up over here for 4 bucks. The Punisher War Journals, number one. This, um, the inks on this book right here are actually done by um, Jim Lee. So, this was a book that I was watching on eBay. But, you know, I watch the stuff, and I try to find it on the wild first. My last resource is eBay, all right? So I was able to pick this Nearman copy of the Punisher War Journals, number one. Love my man, Frank Castle, man. And just another number one to add to the Frank Castle collection. Got a lot of his key issues. And then I was missing this issue right here. Um, the Punisher, that's the five-part miniseries. Uh, by Mike Sack, I was missing number two. I won those books on a giveaway, and I found it yesterday at a lo uh, the local comic book shop that I went to. So I was happy to knock that book off the list to complete my fire, my five-part mini run. And then I picked up Wolverine's um, Origins right here. This is uh, the variant by, uh, I forgot his first name, Su Sudam or something like that. Um, the first appearance of Dakin. Um, Wolverine's son. I picked that up for cover price um, in their long boxes. Then same local comic book shop right there, man. Captain Marvel number 18. This is where um, Carol Danvers gets her powers. I think this might be a little bit better copy than the one that I have or whatever. You know, this book over here on eBay, you know, that's just like 30, 35 bucks. So something nice to be on the lookout for. And I found Deadpool Merc with a mouth number seven in their back issue bins uh, for $3.95. First appearance of Lady Deadpool. You know, hit up, hit up those um, back issues, man. There's always deals to be had. Then another one that I picked up right here, man. 
Wolverine and Deadpool, the decoy one shot. Scotty Young variant, picked that up for four bucks. Um, not a bad deal, not a bad deal. Uh, some more of those three for f or five for 20 pickups today at the local con. Iron Fist number five. Um, this is the first appearance of somebody, man. I forgot who it is. Oh, there it is. Scimitar in the front cover. It's not minor. Um, but I mean, like I said, five for 20. So might as well pick up some minor issues, right? Minor key issues if you're going to drop the 20 on it. And then this book right here, man, I was after it at the Big Apple Con, but people wanted outrageous amounts of money, man. Um, X-Men 201, the first appearance of Baby um, Cable. People at the Big Apple Con, man, wanted 40 to 50 bucks for this book, man. Hell no. Oh, hell no. You hear an announcement in the, in the movies and stuff, and then books like this that you couldn't find before for a dollar or two. You know, now people want 40 to 50 bucks, man. What the hell? Um, I'll pay 10 bucks. Why not? You know, but I'm not paying no damn 40 to 50 bucks for that book. Hell no. And then, man, um, there was this dealer, man. He had his books marked 50% uh, off all Silver Age books or whatever. So, you know, I picked up a few books and, you know, my uh, local dealer that I always buy from, he said, like, man, why are you buying crap from that dude? He doesn't have any key issues. All he has is filler issues. You know, he's trying to lure people in. You're not going to find good deals in his bins, you know. So, this is what I picked up. And I'm going to show you guys. You know, you have to know what you're looking for, man. You have to know what the key issues are or what you're into. If you just go blindly and you don't know what you're looking for, man, you can't find deals if you don't know what you're looking for. That's like sticking your hand, you know, uh, looking for something in the dark, man. You're not going to find it. So I'm proud to say that I found some key issues. That's Strange Tales 148. Um, that's the origins of the ancient one. And that's a big shout out to Big Tim, man. TVO14 because he showed it on one of his videos. And I think he showed it on a character hi highlight. So I picked that book up for seven bucks. Um, it was 14 originally. So 50% off is seven. So, you know, boom. A minor key issue, but not uh, key issue nonetheless. Then I picked up Strange Tales 150. Uh, first appearance of Umar. That's um, Dormammu's sister. And that's also the first J, um, John Buscema work in marvel so boom another key man do try to tell me there's no keys in there man come on man and i'm gonna show you the other books that i picked up from him as well all right all right let's get this going man let's get this going because i'm pumped man i'm pumped today i only had like a couple of red bulls so nothing too crazy all right then i got right here the tomb of dracula number one by neo adams a classic neo adams cover man Picked that book up for 45 bucks. Um, I was actually trying to find a copy for Lightning uh, Rich, but he wanted a little better copy for it. So, you know what? For 45 bucks, I didn't have that in my collection. I'll add it to my collection. I'm still on the lookout for that book for Rich, and I'm going to find it for a decent price for a higher grade. So, there's that. Then, this is another book that I picked up from the guy that had the 50% off books. Um silver age keys that the guy told me he didn't have any keys right there that's fantastic for number 20 first appearance of molecule man picked that up for 30 bucks another key another key and that's jack kirby art so boom another key three for three on that one all right keep keep your tabs on on the key issues that i got from old boy over there for 50 percent off i'm trying to defend my books that i picked up with other people you know what i'm saying even the comic dojo was a little bit uh, hesitant about it but, you know, your boy Angel knows what he's doing a little bit, a little bit, you know. Then I picked up this bad boy, man. Forever People, number one. First full appearance of Dark Sea. Um, covered by Jack Kirby. I picked this book up at Maryland yesterday for $6.99. $6.99, man. Boom, score. Even in that condition that, you know, is browning and stuff, that book can fetch, you know, anywhere for 40 to 50 bucks. So picking it up for $6.99, man, it's a deal. It's a deal. All right. Um, Kang the Conqueror is one of my favorite villains next to Thanos. And this man takes uh, a lot of personas, you know. So, uh, Giant Size Defenders number three. 
cover by Jim Starlin. Um, that's the first appearance of Korback. That's another one of um, Kang the Conqueror's identity. So there's that right there. Picked that book up. I think it was for 10 bucks at the end. And then I picked up. This was on, from the other dude that had the 50% off books that uh, they told me that there was no key issues in that pile. It was just a bunch of filler issues. But I already showed you three for three. Let's make it four for four because your boy's good like that. Fantastic Four number 19, man. First appearance of Ramatan. That's another identity that Kang the Conqueror takes. So, you know, Angels 4 for 4 on those deals right there. Pick that book up right there, man, for 35 bucks actually. So, 50% off. I got it for 35 bucks. final price. So, boom. And another Jack Kirby cover. So, Angel was 4 for 4 on his keys, you know, trying to tell me that it was a bunch of filler issues. No, sir. No, no, no. Then, we're getting... Right down to the last two books, man. I picked this book up for 50 bucks. And this book, man, is fucking scorching hot as we speak. Batman 357. First appearance of Jason Todd. And the first appearance of Killer Croc. That book is smoking hot. I picked that book up for 50 bucks. Along with the other giant size defenders from my usual dealer. He gave me 60 bucks on both of them. You can slice it any way you want, 30 30. But you know. Or he gave me this for 50 and then the other one for 10, I guess. And then the biggest book I picked up today, man, was this bad boy right here. Strange Tales 111. Second appearance of Doctor Strange. And the first appearance of uh, Baron Moto. Alright, this is the story behind this book. Um... I was walking around because I was about to leave the con, man. And uh, by the way, this is a Steve Ditko cover. So I was walking around. I was about to leave. You know, the comic dojo was going through his boxes and stuff. I'm walking on the other side. And then I see this um, booth. And I start looking, you know. Start looking, start looking. And then I see the Strange Tales 111. Um, the seller had it in a box. Um, so I asked the lady, I said, excuse me, how much you want for that Strange Tales? She said, oh. My husband just bought it too long ago. He hasn't priced it yet. So let me call him and see how much he wants for it. So I said, all right, cool, cool, cool. He comes back. By the way, this book, the dude bought it from the guy who was selling his keys at 50% off. You know, the guy who didn't have any major keys that only had uh, filler issues, according to my dealer, you know. So anyways, um, he said, well, I just bought it. And... Um, he was like, well, I bought it for um, 65 I can give it to you for 95 what the other dude was uh, selling it. You know, the dude had bought from him before the show started, and he bought this book from him. He was selling my 50% off, so 95 so he bought it for 35 So he was like, I'll give it to you for 95 95 I still felt that it was a good deal for this book because on eBay, they're outrageous. So I ended up picking it up for... 95 bucks the second appearance of dr. Strange and man. This is like a VG copy man VG plus around that area Very very nice copy Very stoked to have this in my collection uh, as you guys remember I picked up strange tales 115 the origins of dr. Strange So there it is guys another haul More keys after more keys after more keys for good deals. You just have to look for the deals man They're in the wild and until next time, YouTube is your boy Angel coming at you with another haul, man. Peace.